Morning everyone, good morning. I'm just rushing on my way to Crayford. I'm a bit late, I do apologise, Celso. I am doing the speed limit though. Today I'm training down at Crayford. We're doing back and shoulders. <coughs> Go on, you fucking idiot. Today's first day, Arsenal managed to beat Bayern Munich 2-0. I don't know if there's many Gunas subscribers watching, but I know there's a few. So a very, very good result for us the other night. Like I said, today is the lighting is very bad. This is England, look. Gloomy old England. We finally hit winter time, but as I said, I'm training shoulders twice a week along with legs and arms and only hitting chest and back once. Now the second shoulder session is probably going to be more compound work today, so sort of like any any overhead pressing and lifts and things like that. I know at Crayford they've got like a Viking press, so we'll smash that out. And generally with the chest and back sessions, because I'm only hitting them once, once, I'm not really doing any isolation work. I'm mainly doing again compound lifts, so today's back session will be sort of rows, single arm dumbbell rows and like heavy lap pull down and things like that. But I've got a rush there now, so I will speak to you in a bit. Hey up lads and ladies, just on here too now. Oh, there's Miller and Carter Steakhouse. Lovely steak in there. Uh, we're just about seven minutes away from Crayford, pre-workout on board. Not a, not a usual pre-workout, just an apple. God, it's nice and sunny now. And we should see him, I made it on time. Thanks to my Lewis Hamilton driving. Look, McDonald's. McDonald's, the last time we were here, look, I was prepping for my show. I remember passing that guy and, oh, I could eat about 10 Big Macs now. Oh, how times have changed. <laughs> oh, there she is, the Crayford. Whose fucking car is that? That is terrible. Just realized we're in Crayford and if I've just slagged off that person's car there, it's probably a massive woman bodybuilder that could beat me up. So I do apologize if it is yours, I'm really sorry, I'm sorry. While I wait for Celso, I'm just gonna put my intra workout in. Etics energy load 70 grams of carbs in there it's very nice red fruits flavor and it has sorry 65.5 grams of carbs and only a gram of sugar designed more for like your, your cyclists and your runners but obviously cycling with its higher carb low fat goes hand in hand with bodybuilding all done look at all the smoke can you see the smoke looks like I'm in crack then Jesse we must cook here he is Frank Zane, how are you? There he is, Frank Zane. I say we haven't met up in a while. Probably gonna not even train. Just slag off, slag off people in the fitness industry. <laughs> Post Crayford meal, we have chicken and rice. Sorry, the camera's a bit shaky. I haven't eaten chicken and rice avec, avec, eh? French women love a little bit of French. We have some spinach to look like Popeye, and uh, just a Lucasaid. Get some more carbs in. I like Lucasaid. Predominantly around training time, really, because half of it is sugar and half of it is just carbs through glucose. So you've got 65 carbs and 33 sugar. So it's not too bad post training. I've got work at 3 till 8, and when I'm back from work, what I do is I do the commentary from the session with Celso in Crayford. See you soon. La quick life hack if you drink Lucasaid out of a bottle or from a glass, you get bloated because of the bubbles. What I do is get the bubbles out. Goes down like water. Carbs on tap. Right, commentary time with a serious mass banana flavour shake. Shoulders and back today. Mainly more, you could call it compound lifts, but rear delt movements is a bit more isolation because you're focusing more on the rear delts. But we start with rear delt flyers with the dumbbells getting slightly more of a, a hold when you are doing your rear delts, not just ch -ch -ch. so more of a hold time and attention sort of thing then we went over to some low cable rows and we went on to viking presses standing viking presses this uh, machine at crayford's an absolute fucking killer it really burns the old delts out it really does uh today's repetition ranges was a high volume so this is high volume week for me so this is anywhere between sort of 18 to 20 reps then we went on to lap pull down this is slightly close grip and it's sort of inverted not your usual out like that um, again, well, at the moment I'm doing sort of five sets for each exercise and the th three sets, the majority of them are sort of, I'd say about 60% and the last two are sort of just all out, blood and guts. Then we finish shoulders off with some side lateral raises. Again, this is isolation-ish, um, but same sort of method. And this is just, cell, cell size back by the way is fucking sick. It's like fucking Cobra. Um, I think the plan for him is to compete in 2017 with me. I don't know if he's going to be doing bodybuilding or physique, but I think he'll clean up physique because the geezer's condition gets on point. 
on screen now is just a, a little physique update. I'm five, well, nearly, well, basically six weeks on Monday off cycle. Strength it's dropping, not a lot, but it isn't the best and it isn't as it always was. It obviously won't be, but I'm trying to hold on to and maintain some size anyway. But I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, keep your eyes peeled for another one. I need to think of some content to put out. Anyway, first dates at 10 o'clock, Channel 4, very good. Cool. See you all soon, much love.